Look at all of us. Let's move all our memories together. They're a little sad now. We should be happy that they happen at all. Let's make some new memories together, okay? boy sleeping in his room. What's his name? Uh, I usually like keeping game names the same. <laughs> Sunny. No. <laughs> no. Wrong Noctics member. This is Baby Fogger. It's mommy. I'm still in the city setting things up for our new home. Did you finish packing yet? The movers are gonna be at our house in a few days, so I left a list of things for you to do before they arrive. Oh, sorry! Mommy messed up. Forgot to tell the electric company that we need a few extra days before we're ready to move, so the lights might cut out sometimes tonight. Anyways, I know moving to a new place can be a little nerve wracking right now, but I think a change of scenery will be positive for the both of us. I know you haven't talked to anyone in a while. But you might want to say goodbye to your old friends before we leave. Kel has been trying really hard to get a hold of you ever since we put our house up for sale. He's been calling us every week for the past few months. He seems a little lonely. Maybe you should pay him a visit. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Why is the bzzz so ominous? Uh-oh. You are hungry. Okay. Um, so we're moving, which is terrible for any child. Losing all your friends, moving to a new place, being left alone. Bath towel. A toilet. Some towels and toiletries. Uh, I don't like that. Feels like something's gonna pop up behind me. An empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Sure. Other one, thanks. <laughs> Oh! Oh. Yeah, okay. This world is real. This world has actual color. The world in his dream is like a storybook world where he's escaping for escapism. It's so dark. Yeah, it's really dark. What? Man, I hate when games do that. I'm like... Yeah, I'm so ready to go. And then the game's like, are you sure you want to go downstairs? <laughs> like, not anymore. <laughs> are you sure you want to go downstairs? Why would you ask me that? Now I'm not so sure. Are you sure you want to go downstairs? I don't like the way it questioned me. Okay. Don't be scared. <laughs> don't be scared. Don't be scared. You're okay. You got this. No? Hi, Sunny. This is a note from Mommy. I'll have some food in the fridge if you go downstairs. It's steak. Your favorite. That explains it. Love you. XOXO. He doesn't want to leave. You don't want to look down. Feel dizzy. Maybe you can sleep it off. Hmm. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Sure.
Uh oh. Well, it's brighter. What? Oh, this is a nightmare, isn't it? Huh? And there's an evil red glow outside. I'm gonna brush my teeth. This is what happens when you don't brush your teeth, kids. An eerie red glow radiates from outside. I feel strangely drawn to it. Okay, that is a long staircase. This is absolutely a dream. That's a long staircase, buddy. I'm just saying. Oh, now you want to go. Now you want to go. You are hungry. But he's shaking his head left and right like he can't go downstairs. You are hungry. Oh, I can move now. I can only move down, though. You are hungry. So this is how he sees the world, huh? Is he having a panic attack? Oh, no, 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 please, no, 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 no. Oh, baby, this is not what I'm talking about. This isn't what I like to see. Pick it up. I really wish I looked out the window. Oh, that's a real hand. Ha! Ah. Is that a real hand? Did they take a picture of somebody's hand and... Oh my god. It's getting real close. Oh, it got a little too close. That died. What in the actual hell is that? Can I run? Uh, no, I can't. Oh, his face is terrifying. What will Folga do? I'm going to fight. I don't have any skills. Yeah, I'm going to fight the shadow monster. Something. Oh, it's shaped like stairs. Folga attacks something, but it did nothing. Oh, what else can I do? Can I run away? Sorry. Yeah! Something taunts Sunny as he falls. Nothing's working anymore. He's just keeping me scared. Take a deep breath. You steady yourself and remember how to calm down. Sunny recovers 40 hearts. Let's go. Calm yourself. Remind yourself that everything's fine. And there's a first aid box over here. Okay. Nice. Okay, that is way shorter than I thought. Oh, Sunny, you are such a relatable character. That's how I feel all the time going downstairs. Now you won't go in there? Surely that's the kitchen. Is this way? The, this looks like the entrance, but okay. Look in the fridge. Cold steak! Let's go! Probably heat it up if we... You what now? Uh, uh, uh. Steak? In a micro... Microwave! Put the cold steak in the microwave. Oh, that'll take a while. Or not. <laughs> it was wrong. You got microwave steak. Oh yes. A lovely, well done steak. I somehow doubt it. Would you like to eat some? Sure. Mmm. Steak. It's kind of cursed. I'd like to think she also left me some vegetables. Nope, just a steak. Oh, we don't need nutrition. We got protein. The meat is so well done. <laughs> oh my god. Oof. Stomach didn't agree with that. 
Yeah, it's a microwaved steak. Oh, God. I'm not feeling so good, Mr. Stark. I'ma be honest. What's this? No? Yeah, me either. You wanna go back up to bed? Let's go to bed. You feel sick? Oh, my God. <laughs> this looks really funny. <laughs> um, I'll go for the toilet. Blech. Yep, he actually threw... Oh, that's not good, actually. He's not even able to eat food right now? Is that the anxiety? I thought he just needed to, like, you use the bathroom really badly. You threw up. I hope you're okay. Wait, was that door open now? Nope. Okay, nope. This is very atmospheric. Coming from here. Everybody is saying, open the door. Did you not learn anything? Hey, Sonny. It's Mari. I'm finally back home, but I forgot my keys. So I somehow seriously doubt that. What is going on? Did you open the door for me? Um. Everybody? Were you not told not to open the door just because? What is going on? Why is it dark? Why is it dark? Oh, I turned around. I do not like the fact that it's giving me this choice. I mean, I'm going to open the door. It's Mari. Are you kidding me? I love Mari. FBI, open up! That's the thing I drew in my book. The one giant eyeball monster. I, okay, let's not do that again. Can we go to bed now? Good night! <gasps> what? I promise, I'm looking. Wait, I need to brush my teeth. <laughs> Most important things first. Hey. Mari, you followed me. Um, you're not looking your best right now. Could I maybe brush my teeth before you fuck with me? Uh, Mama told me to brush my teeth every day. You know about that. You're my big sister. You you want me to take care of myself, right? A bathtub. Oh, she's gone. Okay. Wow. <sighs> that was scary. Oh yeah, let's look. But I want to know what the whole Mari significance was, especially since she was colored entirely differently. I love light mode, yeah. If you guys are watching this late at night, this must be painful. Um... What? I, I blinked for a second, I didn't... I don't know if I... Hold on. Hangman? What? Something found nearby. I gotta get my knife again. No, it's not a knife. Let's go. You found a map. Ooh. Ooh. Um, okay. Can we leave now? I guess we can. Open the door. Yay! 
I like this area way better than real life. Omori! Thank goodness you're here. Have you seen Basil? You can't find him any anywhere. We should go tell Mari you're okay. She's been worried sick. Okay, poor Mari. Uh, I've been kind of worried sick about Mari in my own way. <laughs> oh, baby, I hope you weren't knocking on the door last night or else I might have... Is this a photo of someone familiar? <sighs> Did my sister die? Two hundred clams. I'm rich. Damn, I'm making bank. Let's go, Yanko Sensei. Oh, I'm not in the playground anymore. <gasps> why are there bloody footprints leading to Basil's house? Ooh, a key. Now, why are there footprints written in blood? Here, let's not go there. Let's go somewhere else. Let's go up here. North is cool. Hey. Hey. Why is the music kind of distorted? I don't like the fact that it's called Hangman. I'm gonna I'm gonna go explore the playground before I go find Basil. I wanna see. The lack of music's rather terrifying. What the hell is happening? Who are you? You wanna build castles with your friends? Yeah! That sounds fun. Oh my god, Kel's going ham. Holy shit. Kel made himself. Why is there an oo-woo here? Why is there an oo-woo? This is like mood whiplash the game. Actually, really. You're afraid of drowning. Okay, I'm sorry. Does that still happen? What if I stay here? Okay, I get it. Afraid of drowning. Gotcha. That's creepy. Mari. I'm already here, okay. Oh, she hugged us. Don't worry me like that. Hmm. Where's Basil? He's not with you, Amari. No. I'm afraid not. The last thing I remember was sorting photos with Basil in his house. Next thing I know, I'm waking up in Neighbor's room with Aubrey and Cal. Neighbor's room. At least we found you, Amori. But I hope Basil is okay. We're going to protect him if we're not... Who's going to protect him if we're not there? Don't be such a downer, Aubrey. We'll find Basil in no time. Absolutely right, Cal. At the at times like these, we're gonna have to stay positive. Thanks, Mari. Hmm. Why don't we go back to Basil's house? There might be something that we missed. That's the spirit hero. And as always, I'm here if you need me. Let's go. Ah, everything is sus! Whoa, a floating mirror. Wow, that's so cute! A floating mirror. Aw, I've seen fan art of this. I remember right around debut uh, seeing a fan art of, uh, of uh, Luxium like this. Is he still back here? Hey, boss. <gasps> oh. Basil's missing again. Wasn't me this time, I promise. Now leave me alone to repent. How are you repenting? You're hiding. You suck. Did you really? You put up the sign again? Wanted. Alive. Pluto. AKA the ninth planet of the solar system. No reward. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so if we're checking out where Basil is, we should go to where his house is, right? Yeah, it's in this direction. <gasps> These flowers, they're already dying. 
We should do our best to take care of them until Basil gets back. Do you like to water the plants? Yes! Oh no. Um, do, do the thing. There we go. Now they're safe. I'm already getting one heart. For watering the plants. They all look okay. They're fine. I'm good. Cactuses never need to be watered. They're going to be absolutely amazing. Why does the music seem eerie? Right? I like a lot of the peaceful stuff. Occasionally, it just gives me this off feeling, and I can't really put my finger on as to why. Yeah! Do you think Basil is okay? I feel like maybe we should be more worried. Hmm. His disappearance is concerning, but it won't help anyone to get too worked up over it. Basil is really trusting. He'll believe anything anyone says. What if someone tricked him into something? Maybe he's fallen into a trap. Calm down, Aubrey. I'm sure we'll find him. Oh, Aubrey, come on. I don't like it when you cry. Cheer up. On the outside, Basil may seem really soft, but he's actually pretty strong on the inside. Basil can take care of himself. You should believe in him a little bit more. Well, when you put it that way... Okay, I'll try to believe in Basil. Thanks, Cal. <laughs> oh, don't smile at me, it's creepy. You're creepy! A <laughs> uh, little bit of a tsin tsin. My heart... I should save, actually. Hmm, mm, 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 mm. Oh, friend or foe, <laughs> there it goes, with the creepy <laughs> sound. Ah, what are you? Looks like a shadowy fish if I tilt my hand. <gasps> Who the hell? Well, there doesn't seem to be anything out of the ordinary other than that floating Eye of Darkness thing. You think Basil just left somewhere without telling us? I don't know. That doesn't sound like him. He's usually so considerate about these things. Guys, I'm really worried. Is there nothing we can do? What if we can't find him? What if he's in danger? Stay calm, Aubrey. I'm worried too, but that won't solve anything. Let's go look around the forest. Maybe you wandered off and got lost. Yeah, cheer up, Aubrey. We'll find Basil. You guys are right. Okay, we gotta keep our hopes up. Let's go look for Basil in the vast forest. Hey, yo, I don't know, buddy. This little thing on the ground is a little sus. I don't know how you guys ain't noticing this little black mark on the ground, but it's pretty sus. The goddamn photo album. How dare. Oh, maybe he did. Ah. 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 Shadow caviar? <laughs> Freaking excuse me? Nobody leaves their house with the fireplace on. I'm just saying. That's a little dangerous, especially if you live in a house with a bunch of plants. I'm just saying. Believe in the basil that believes in cow. Hell yeah. Train station or pinwheel forest? Maybe pinwheel forest. Shadow caviar. <laughs> That's going to live rent free in my head for a while. Okay, this was the train station. Oh, wait, this is the vast forest. It's a land beyond your wildest dreams. The pinwheels are everywhere. And the serene wind blows through your hair. There's a watermelon out there. And a little bunny rabbit, which I'm probably going to hunt for sport. Yami no caviar. 
Basil! Basil, where are you? I know. I bet my pet rock will know what to do. Oh, it's a rock. I thought it was a potato. Hector, be a good boy. Go find Basil. <laughs> Hector's just like, bruh, I, I don't got this. There's a lot of things I got in life. This, I do not got. Hector has sprite art. That's so cute. Mm. You tried your best, buddy. Oh my god. This is no time to fool around, Kel. Hey, why you... Hector was just trying to help. Let it go, you two. We need to keep ourselves focused. <laughs> I love Hector. Can I use Hector? <laughs> I don't know how to do other. <laughs> A bunny! Oh. We need more healing items. Ooh, a watermelon. You got apple juice. Those are what items look like in this game. That's adorable. Oh. I had no idea I could do that. Jax. What do you mean, Jax? What does that mean? What is that? Deals small damage to all foes and reduces their speed. Okay. Wait, what are these footprints? This is ominous. Oh. Hmm. I don't know, guys. I don't think Basil is in this forest. We haven't even searched the whole forest yet. We can't stop now. Cheer up, Aubrey. Aubrey. <laughs> We'll keep searching till we find him. Maybe we should meet up with Mari at the playground. Oh, if we don't find Basil soon, maybe we should meet up with Mari at the playground and figure out what to do from there. That looks like Basil, but a shadow. What? Or... I'm in a creepy area. Goddess. That kind of looks like... Oh, they're gone. Someone was there. They were a ghost, but they were there. Oh, and does this go endless? No, okay. I was about to wonder if that goes endlessly to the right. Oh my goodness. This is a pretty long ladder, huh? Yeah, it's pretty tall. We're not as uh, tall as the uh, one east of the stump. That one goes all the way up to space. You're really afraid of heights, aren't you, Omori? It's okay. We don't have to look up there. What? I use a healing item. We'll be fine. Oh, God. Hey, buddy. You gotta do the disappear thing? Yep, you are. Hi, I'm the Wise Rock. I give solid advice in exchange for clams. What kind of advice would you like me to give? Bad advice? Sh let's have some bad advice. Understood. Here is your advice. Anything is okay as long as you don't get caught. I hope this helps. Oh. Okay, what do you consider good advice? Understood. Here is your advice. Never make eye contact while eating a banana. Uh, good advice. 
understood. Here is your advice. Life is short, so smile while you still have teeth. This is such a freaking ripoff. Oh, man, I can't believe I spent so many clams on that. Big bone. Get him a big bone. He got candy. We traded. Why is everything a watermelon? I don't question things. This is a do Oh, look at that doggo. Big bone. Small bone. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Nourishment. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see if we can go back to Mari. What is this? Why are there... Oh, hello everyone, how's it going? Have you found Basil yet? No, we haven't. Hey, Mari. No luck so far, I'm afraid. Oh. I'm sorry, guys. I wish there was a way I could help more. We're doing our best. Wait. Maybe we begin with... First your heart, then your valuables. Maybe we should start looking outside the forest. Um, okay, Cal. I know. Why don't we try climbing that really long ladder? The one east of the stump. We can't do that. Omarty is afraid of heights. What if Basil is somewhere up there? We gotta take our chances. I know, but... Uh, Omari, you're growing stronger and stronger every day. You can handle climbing a ladder, can't you? Come on, little brother. Face your fears. It's natural to be nervous at first, but you should know that we all believe in you. Come on, Amari. It's just one measly little ladder. What's the worst that can happen? I don't know about this. You think you're gonna be okay, Omari? Say less. Okay, if you're okay with it, then I'm okay with it too. But if you get scared, you can always count on me to back you up. Thanks, Amori. You've got some real courage. Whoa! Let's go, let's go to the ladder east of the stump. We'll see you later, Mari. Uh, bye, bye now. Stay safe. Remember, Amori, you're stronger than you think. Oh, she's so sweet. I'm gonna eat your candy. Thanks for the candy. Later, Mari. <laughs> the footsies. Oh, yeah, we kind of overcame heights, though. Apparently, I'm getting stronger now. I'm able to overcome heights. Oh, there's more bloody footprints. Lovely. <laughs> I've just decided these are bloody footprints, to be fair. Remember what Myri said, Omori. You're stronger than you think. Don't worry. We'll be right behind you. Yeah, and if you fall, we'll be right there to catch you. Kel, don't scare him. You won't fall, Omori. I promise. You won't fall! Oh no, oh no. You're fine, Omori, you got this. The hands can't get you, your friends are here. Aubrey, touch him on the shoulder. There we go. You are no longer afraid of heights. Oh. Oh, that was the same piano note that um, we heard when we calmed down on the on the stairs. You are no longer afraid of heights. <gasps> Man, I knew there's a reason why, why we never climbed this ladder, but I can't put my finger on it. It's on the tip of my tongue. Oh well, here goes nothing. Is there something dangerous up here and we've just forgotten about it? I'm still in a dream, snake eater. Wait, uh, hold up, guys. Shoot. Where is he? I just had him. Where is who? Hector, my pet rock. Oh, no. I swear I just had him in my pocket. No! Hector! He must have fallen out of my pocket when I wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry, Hector. I should have been more careful. What's the big deal? It's just a rock, right? Don't you dare say that. He's not just a rock. He's family. Don't worry. I'm sure he'll turn up soon, Cal. Probably. I sure hope so. Wait for me, Hector. I'll find you. I promise. Snake! What 
<laughs> yeah! What a thrill! <laughs> he has a little... He has a little astronaut helmet. What the heck? That's so cute. Oh. Ooh, what is this? This kind of reminds me of Terraria for some reason. Am I the only one? First! How did you beat me? Um, hero? A good buddy. Hero took a while. The <laughs> ladder. It just. <laughs> never ends. <laughs> One. Second. <laughs> just. Catch you, my breath. Actually. Actually give me a minute. I give you a minute, don't worry. Oh, we're back to being a train. Cheep. Other world campsite. Cheep. Cheep, cheep. Cattail field. I'll take the field, thank you. I want some cattails. <gasps> Hello, buddy. Shoot. I know I left my donut somewhere around here. Okay, I guess I'm coming back when, once I found a donut. world <gasps> dinosaur dragon spaceship with an whole opening for a what how well so how is mari everywhere getting a little bit worried about mari <laughs> ah yes some lovely space tube food would you like to eat some absolutely look at that big tv Dumbo. Happy! Cute. <laughs> so many humans today. Guys are always such big fans of space travel. Welcome to Otherworld, an unofficial pit stop for wary space travelers in a popular family friendly camping ground. Huh. Don't you just love the smell of firewood? And the sound of running water? And the crisp space breeze? Ah, it makes it the vast emptiness of space a little more bearable, don't you think? You could say it's otherworldly, dun dun. Wanna have a picnic with your friends? Hell yeah. You still haven't found Basil, though. When I grow up, I'm gonna be a space pirate. And I'm gonna travel around all the universe. I wonder what kind of friends we'll meet. What foes we'll face. It'll be an epic journey to end all journeys! You're way too carefree about this, Kel. Did you forget that we're looking for Basil? Remember? Our dear friend Basil who needs us? Yeah, I know, I know. I'm just trying to be positive. I have complete faith that we will save him. Besides, the heroes always win. Isn't that right, hero? <laughs> Very funny, Cal. Well, he's not wrong, though. If this is the right kind of story, the heroes do always win. A floating mirror. Your friends smile warmly behind you. You Horse water. Huh? Um, this guy looks pretty intimidating. Do you want to disturb him? Sure, let's be brave. Oh, I know you. You're from the Wanted poster. What is with this music? What did I just do? Oh my god, it's a centaur. Oh, it's Pluto. Oh no. Oh fuck. What? Can I run? I don't think I'm ready for this. 
shit. Hmm. Not bad. And away I go! Arigato! Soshite! Arigato! I'm small. <laughs> the world's smallest centaur! No! Not the way your name is small! Little centaur, first place. Oh my god. Tiniest centaur, first place. Miniest centaur, first place. <laughs> Why do they have all these awards? Did you make them for yourself? Mm, let's see. What the heck? This is very anime. A table full of merchandise of an obnoxious looking person. Then why isn't it... Why doesn't it look like me then? Oh my god. Hi! I'm Pessy! And as you probably noticed, I love Sweetheart! I get every piece of merchandise she's ever released! I got Sweetheart posters, figures, stickers, shirts, and her entire discography and anything else you can think of! I'm certain you won't find me more true my collection anywhere else in the world! Calling me a super fan is an understatement! I am the ultimate fan! Let me tell you about my time I almost met Sweetheart! We just happened to be eating at the same restaurant! It was fate, I think! Huh? We ordered the same meal too! Not like I totally saw what she ordered and copied her or anything! I even tried to pay for her meal, but I had just bought a newly released Sweetheart life-size statue the day earlier, so I couldn't afford to. Uh, which I guess ended up being a good thing, since that girl turned out to be a regular girl wearing a costume that kind of looked like a Sweetheart anyways. Not like I couldn't tell at first glance. Only a posture fan would ever mistake a regular person for a Sweetheart. Man, guys, this is gonna get some help, ma'am. Oh, <laughs> wait for it. I fucking love it. Painting of an obnoxious looking person. Surprisingly normal bed. The laugh man. Oh my god, oh Marty, you're crazy. Obnoxious looking person. Oh my god, what do you have against sweetheart? Oh Marty, what do you have about what do you have against sweetheart? Uh-oh. You got can. Recycle. Laramie. I'm good again. A band of space pirates has been camping out here for a long time now. I hear that the captain suddenly decided he wasn't going to travel anymore, so half of the crew took his ship and left. Ah, uh, yes. I know the storyline for this anime. You look like a pirate. Oh, you are! Halt, children. You are now entering the vicinity of... The captain of space pirates. The master of the solar system. The prince of the universe. The one and only S Captain Space. B I mean, uh, um, you were entering the house of Space Boyfriend. Whoa, the captain of the Space Pirates lives here? That's awesome! I want to be a Space Pirate too! Well, well. So did I. Once. Space boyfriend doesn't do much these days, so most of space pirates got fed up and left the man, the the main ship. It's just stragglers, stragglers here and doing all sort of space boyfriend's chores and whatever. Yesterday, me and the guys spent the rest of the day cleaning and throwing away all of his trash. Huh? I didn't leave my old job for this. I ain't no babysitter. Oh, I'm sorry. That sounds awful. Maybe we can talk some sense into him. Oh, I, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Uh, Captain Space, I mean, Space Boyfriend, got two sides in you, see? I should at least try. You never know. He might know something about how to find Basel. Or maybe he knows how to find my pet rock, Hector. Yeah, sure, that too. 
What are we waiting for? Let's go see him already. Sorry about your job, sir. It'll get better soon, I promise. <sighs> Thank you, little lady. Sure hope so. Space boyfriend? Oh my god, they all look the same. Buddy, it sucks that you had to come at a time like this.